There are several different hazards that will be impeding your way to collect all of the stars. The first of these hazards is the spikes. If your candy hits a spike, you lose. It's that simple. You'll have to use all of the items presented in the level to avoid them. The convenient thing about spikes, though, is that they are not a timed obstacle, so you can take your time getting around them. Spiders, on the other hand, you have to handle quick. Once you become attached to a rope with a spider attached, it will begin crawling towards the candy, and you'll have to sever yourself from that rope before the spider gets to you. These little buggers can be rather frustrating, so try to know what you're going to do before you become attached to one of their ropes. The final hazard you'll have to deal with are electric sparks. These sparks turn on and off at a regular pace, so the key to handling sparks is to be patient and take your time. Use the items that you are currently attached to to simply wait until the sparks deactivate, then go right on through. They can be rather frustrating to deal with, but as long as you're patient, you shouldn't have too much of a problem with them. Now that I've introduced you to all the items and hazards that you're going to encounter on your quest, you're ready to embark on your trip through Cut the Rope. However, if you have any issues with a specific level, please check out the level videos where I show you level by level how to collect all three stars.